Welcome back to another Retro Mania Wrestling Developers Vlog. Happy New Year to everybody. Uh, it's been a hectic couple weeks for probably everybody. So hopefully this video will take your mind off of other things and puts it on Retro Mania Wrestling. So we've been up to a lot, working on the game, trying to get this update complete, but everything is going well. So I'm going to kind of jump right in. It's going to be a little bit different of a format. And I'm going to start a video in the background and play it right now. So, this is just some gameplay footage of Lace Build. I just wanted to show a couple things off as we're going in here. As you'll see in the menu, we have some version tracker information. Uh, that actually wasn't updated. This is from the 4th. Actually, it's from the 6th. Uh, we got to update the timestamp on that. Um, this is kind of our little debug menu where I can just hit uh, a keyboard command and go right into a match. So, well, hey, look who's back, everybody. Um, it's the underwear, guys. Uh, so... I just wanted to jump in here to show how we're testing a couple of the new moves that are in the game. So there's the Rocket by Bay. Um, we're releasing it because the obviously the player has a lot of stamina still. And there's some a couple of her, of Chris Bay's moves that we're just going through here, just to show off how they're looking in the game. I really love the way they're looking, by the way, uh, especially that one. Uh, so. There's just a couple of Chris Bay's new moves. I'm just going to play through them a couple times. And there's, we're making some tweaks. You'll notice there to War Horse's uh, double stop of death, as he calls it, off the top rope. We're playing with the timing from some moves. And there you'll just see there, I love that. We are also tweaking some other moves so that they do more ring out. So that's specifically for the Retro Rumble. Uh, we, I felt like it needed something else, and a bunch of the other guys did as well. So we wanted to make some other moves that we'll now throw throw opponents out of the ring. So we're working on that. Um, and this is just kind of ancillary stuff as we're getting Chris Bay into the game and as we're working on the new wrestlers. So we're doing those things simultaneously. But other guys on the team had some downtime um, while we're, we're, we're finalizing and tweaking some art and animations and stuff like that. So we decided we'd tweak some other things that we wanted to do as well. So you'll see here we just have a match between... Um, Dreamer and, and Nova and we're just going through a couple of uh, the animation things a couple of different things that uh, I want to point out here that we're tweaking on that we've changed uh, as we go through this but that's kind of what we're doing now is since we have a pretty uh, a decent number of people uh, who have some free time while we're waiting on the Chris Bay stuff is being worked on simultaneously uh, we, we're trying to clean up as much as we can Add a few tweaks here and there. Um, and one of the things I wanted to show here is right there, uh, you can hear a little ding in the background. So I think this is kind of a classic that's been in wrestling games back to uh, back to old school games, especially the Aki games. It's a little ding when you get hit, hit below the belt, so to speak. So just little tweaks like that. Uh, we added the, we changed Nova's leg drop to a running leg drop, more of the kind of Hollywood Nova that he is. So we just want, we're, we're going through the game and really trying to fine tune everything for a couple reasons. One, you know, just stuff needed to be cleaned up. I didn't like, the guys on the team didn't like, and we need to make changes to things like that. Two, we are doing a physical release in limited run games in the future. So all this stuff, I really want that, that is going to be the one that's kind of etched in time, so to speak. And so I want to get that one, you know, as, as perfect as, as we can. You know, we've, we've gone through and we've gotten feedback from people playing the game. There's still a handful of fatal errors that are very rare, but we're trying to weed all of those out and get them uh, done as well. You know, just adding little things, uh, like here, we're, we're back in the versus mode. I'll call your attention back to the screen behind me. Um, doing, doing a versus match. And, and I alluded to this before, but doing little things like just adding the nameplates across the screen that come in. Little tweaks like that that I, I think add a lot to the, the overall game. Um, and again, this isn't taken away from the stuff, you know, the high priority stuff that we want to get in. Specifically, Chris Bay working on James Storm, working on Mr. Hughes in the background. Chris Bay by far is the furthest along, um, but we also are working on James Storm as well. So, you know, little things, we tweaked uh, that clothesline animation there. Uh, and, and other things, we just want to make the game as great as it can be. 
So what else have we been working on, you ask? Um, we have a tweak. Uh, speaking of the Xbox achievement, that was on our list. Obviously, that's going in. Uh, we were, were looking at all the achievements. Some of the things like five times, five times, five times on all platforms seem to be triggering on six on some. Uh, and we, we had other issues on the Steam that uh, and some users pointed out for us this past week that we, we tweaked and we, we really went through all of them and made sure they were all working correctly. So um, we had a couple issues where they were triggering but not at the right times and things of that nature. Back to an update we made in October uh, for just on Steam for that specific reason. So we have all those fixed and we also added on the Steam front we added um, progress bars on, on the ones that you take. So now you'll know how many matches you have left for the 50. You'll just notice in the background there, if you were watching the, the background, not watching my pretty face, the, the drop kick sending somebody over the top rope, you know? So it's a bunch of stuff like that uh, that we've been working on. So I think I'm repeating myself a little bit, you get the idea. But that's it. I um, hope everyone's having a great week, and we will give you another update next week. A lot of exciting stuff going on. Thanks. Bye.